how are you doing today all fine so with the surgery I had recently where my PGO assisted with so I'll be giving you and I'll be prescribing you some medications kindly take them routinely and rest is very much required for your recovery okay Vikram 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 where is Vikram what are you Vikram. doing man is over here hey Vikram I have a good news for you Vikram we have this huge opportunity okay there's this concert tomorrow we'll make lots of money here. sir this is highly against our advice it doesn't matter your surgery is over anyway you have to do he this. had surgery he needs you to take rest to it's a very important concert it's an incredible opportunity lots of people will be there you we'll get lots of exposure you know you have to come you have to do this for the company There's only 10 minutes left for the stage. Please don't pull all this right now. Come on. I don't know what happened, doctor. He just fainted during singing, um, and he also told something about muscle pain, doctor. I'm really worried, doctor. Are you all right now? So I'll be doing some physical examinations on you. Just relax, okay? I'll be just tapping on your face. Now, please put the PP cuff on. Hello sir, are you feeling better? Pretty good, alright. So yesterday we went through some physical examinations of you. So as well as we took some blood tests. So we're just waiting for the reports to arrive. So, after analyzing your reports and based on your clinical signs and symptoms, you have been diagnosed to have a hypercalcemia. And this hypercalcemia is a rare complication following the surgery. Rest is assured, we will take care of you and treat your hypercalcemia in a better way, in every way possible, in speedy recovery. As she said, we will help you recover as soon as possible. But here, these are some of the signs and symptoms that you'll notice. Parathyroid gland and tetany. Hypocalcemic tetany due to PTH deficiency. Parathyroid gland. It is located in front of the neck, embedded in the thyroid gland. It is 4 in number. It secretes parathormone and also increases blood calcium levels. Calcium metabolism. 
the players are mr pth and miss Vit- vitamin d the basketball court is the blood circulation in vessels calcium and phosphate are two different balls they are released into the blood stream with the help of mr pth and miss vitamin d in the gastrointestinal tract calcium and phosphates are absorbed and enters the blood stream with the help of miss vitamin d in the kidney phosphate is excreted out with the help of mr pth miss vitamin d and mr pth hold hands together and helps in the calcium reabsorption and thus calcium reaches the blood stream miss vitamin d alone helps in the reabsorption of phosphate from the kidney and phosphate enters the blood stream vitamin d and pth promotes bone resorption and releases calcium and phosphates into the blood stream but calcitonin has antagonistic activity towards vitamin d and pth and causes bone deposition tetany reduce blood calcium levels hence normal inhibition of sodium channels are not achieved subthreshold stimuli results in excitation of neuron as the threshold potential is increased so hypoparathyroidism vitamin d deficiency and excess thyrocalcitonin functions pth increases calcium reabsorption and thus increases the plasma calcium levels pth also increases phosphate excretion and thus decreases plasma phosphate levels pth helps in hydroxylation of alpha 5 hydroxy coal calciferol to 1,25 dihydroxy coal calciferol thus active form of vitamin d is obtained this promotes calcium reabsorption in git and the kidneys and also causes calcium mobilization in bones pth binds to the receptors of osteoblast and osteoclast thus it promotes maturation of osteoclast and bone resorption by osteoclast pth activates osteocytic osteolysis and increases the blood calcium levels signs and symptoms laryngospasm occlusion of laryngeal passage is observed chvostek sign contraction of facial muscles is observed trousseau sign flexion of the wrist and the thumb extension of fingers is observed carpopedal spasm wrist is flexed fingers extended thumbs adducted over the palm feet extended and adducted hypocalcemia normal calcium level 8.6 to 10.3 mg per dl so here the calcium level is less than the normal reference hyperphosphatemia normal phosphate level 2.8 to 4.5 mg per dl so here the phosphate level is more so in this case of thyroidectomy there is accidental removal of parathyroid gland which will lead to parathamone deficiency pth causes resorption of bone and also increases the calcium levels in the blood so in this case there is less resorption of bone leading to less calcium levels in blood so no blocking of sodium channels are present so action potential is produced even due to small stimuli less than the threshold potential so there is hyper excitation of neurons leading to muscle spasms treatment ionized calcium and pth supplements are given to treat tetany Yeah. <laughs>